Just to show you the kind of errands I sometimes have to run during the day, I thought I'd take a time lapse of me traveling around Ennis doing different things that I had to do today. First stop, post office. It's in the 20s today. It's about 26 degrees right now. Now I'm driving uh, over to the drugstore in Ennis. And I'm just going to go by the house I used to live in. Just because I like to take a look and see how it's doing. Just, I just drove by it. You didn't see it. <laughs> this is the main street of Ennis. That's the drugstore. I'm going in to get my drugs. Remember seeing Elsie Cunningham used to sit out in front of the drugstore just to say hi to people. That was a lady I met when I first got here. She'd been living there. Well, she was a her and her husband. Or, uh, owned a ranch up in the north near Helen, I think, and she was a camp cook. Knew her husband knew, uh, by the way, that was the dump. Her husband knew, uh, Gary Cooper when he was growing up. Now I'm heading back to Ennis. Beautiful sunny day, I just a little icy on the roads. Now I'm the dollar store for a couple things. Now I'm heading home again. I am stopping at the stop sign, except the time lapse doesn't show that. That's the house I live in. I gotta run in and take in the stuff I bought at the dollar store and pick up a package that I got by mistake from the post office and take it back to the post, post office. Back to the post office. There's a package sent to me a bunch of little kids' books by mistake from some lady who mailed it to herself in Sun Valley, Idaho, but it came to me instead because it had my address on it. Have no clue. And that's the end of my trip. Time to play with some play. Now, the first thing I'm going to do today is take her off uh, because I need to. Uh, she's uh, in the way of me working on details of him. So, I think she's held on by one screw. The heater's on, and I'm sorry, it just kicked in. But we'll just have to live with it today because it is cold. It's about 20 some odd degrees outside Fahrenheit be right back I hope you guys enjoyed that little trip around Ennis <laughs> we don't have garbage pickups so you have to make a run all the way out to the dump which is about three or four miles out of town all right Let's get started on him. I'm really happy with his face the way it's turned out. I'm going to do some work on his upper lip, but I'll wait to do that. I want to get uh, his hand worked out. 
Uh, you can see part of the armature right there. I'm going to take the shield off. Can't remember how I had that on there. Yeah, I like the, uh, the shield on his back. Just got to decide which part of his back, or even which part of his area that he's going to be carrying it. I'm going to put a blanket on him, and I'm just trying to think how to do that. Blanket on the horse, that is. I'd just like to uh, remind you about the uh, instructional DVDs that I have for sale on how to sculpt. I've got nine of them. And uh, there's a link in the description below this video on how to uh, or where to purchase them. And yesterday's video, I showed you how to purchase them and how to to uh, select what you want and uh, where to go to do that if you want to take a review of that video from yesterday. It's at the end of the video. I didn't want to bore you with it at the beginning of it, but uh, it's there if you want to take a look. It helps, uh, you know, keeps me financed as far as being able to uh, create these videos and uh, helps me to buy the clay. Clay that I get from Sculpture Depot, by the way. Dot net. I've anchored uh, both this this arm and that arm so they won't be flying up in the air and 
and uh, this is taking longer than I thought it would take, so I'm gonna have to call it quits here because I gotta go fix dinner. I'll put his loincloth on tomorrow. I'm gonna work on his legs a little bit more tomorrow. And uh, I need to find a way of getting I, I Am The Way to the uh, foundry so they can give me a bid on what it would cost to cast that bronze. Uh, and because uh, I've got several people interested in it, and I've got to uh, do that. They're also coloring uh, a couple of bronzes today that I'd like to be able to check on maybe tomorrow. But it's supposed to snow, and it's clouding up like it's going to. It's uh, almost 6 o'clock, about 10 to 6. So I'm going to call it quits here. Sorry it wasn't much more than this. But uh, that's the way it goes sometimes. You just do what you can and take your time. Don't rush it. I'm not that good. Uh, if I was better, I'd be able to do this in a day. But I like taking my time. It gives me time to think about what I'm doing. All right, everybody. I hope you have a great night, and I'll see you uh, next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right, see you next time.